keeps me in a routine. He keeps me, um, I think he keeps me as a good person because he's my best friend. He's the only family I've got that actually lives with me. And uh, he's what I wake up to every morning at 4 o'clock. And when I go to bed at night, at 8 o'clock at night, it's the last thing I see. <laughs> and he's just the most wonderful, nicest, kindest little creature you want to meet in your life. I treat him like one of my kids. And uh, in 2004, he had uh, surgery. He had an extra vertebrae in his, back, his spinal cord. We'd been in pain all of his life, but we didn't know he had an extra vertebrae, which prevented the, the spinal cord from moving properly. During surgery, the bone had broke, and the doctor touched the spinal cord and paralyzed him. He uh, didn't mean to. It was, it was purely by accident. The bone broke, and just one thing led to another. So now he's, uh, he's a paraplegic, and he, he can't walk, but I love him just the same. I wouldn't trade him for anything. We go for walks, uh, about a quarter mile of walk in the morning, and uh, I put him in a harness, and I just take him for a walk. And if you're not careful, he'll run you to death. So I get my exercise, he gets his exercise. Boy, here we go. Where are you going to go today? Here we go. There we go. Here we go. So he runs me, and I go where he goes. It's not my walk. It's all about him. Everything involves Lewis. <laughs> you are his rear legs. <laughs> Come on. After we're done with our run, we go right to the garage where he leads me to the garage because now it's time to play baseball. This is a little tram that uh, a friend of mine and me hooked up here. He'll hook his pants up to that. What I do is I force his legs to stand, force him to stand. Uh, we do exercises right off the bat, and I do 80, what I, what I call ups and downs. Five, six, and seven. And I'll take his tail, eight, and I'll, I'll squeeze eight, a certain eight, portion of his tail, and he'll go, he'll go up, and eight, then all of a sudden he'll go back down again. So I figure 80 repetitions of that to, get, to keep his muscles in tone so they don't totally atrophy. Gonna get that ball right there. Go get that ball right there. Get that ball. Okay. Heel. Come on. Come on, that a boy. Come on, all the way down. Oh, no, no, no. He's very important to me, and I'm Good very boy. important to him too. That a boy. The next five years, he'll still be around. He's gonna live to a ripe old age. I'll probably be in my 70s. There you go. <laughs> I'll, pro I'll probably be in a walker before he will. As I can. There he goes. He would put his life before mine, his own life. That's got my vote as my best friend. That's that's what he means to me. You know, I would put my life before his. That's the way it is. Here you go. Give me a kiss. I know. Yeah, uh, yeah I know. Thank you. Thank you.